Matthew 19, verse 1. Marriage and Divorce. Now it came to pass, when Jesus had finished these sayings, that he departed from Galilee, and came to the region of Judea, beyond the Jordan. And great multitudes followed Jesus, and he healed them there. The Pharisees also came to Jesus, testing him, and saying to him, Is it lawful for a man to divorce his wife for just any reason? And Jesus answered and said to them, Have you not read? that he who made them at the beginning made them male and female, and said, For this reason a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. So then they are no longer two, but one flesh. Therefore what God has joined together, let no man separate. They said to Jesus, Why then did Moses command to give a certificate of divorce and to put her away. He said to them, Moses, because of the hardness of your hearts, permitted you to divorce your wives, but from the beginning it was not so. I say to you, whoever divorces his wife, except for sexual immorality, and marries another, commits adultery. And whoever marries her who is divorced commits adultery. The disciples said to Jesus, if such is the case of the man with his wife, it is better not to marry. Verse 11, Jesus teaches on celibacy. But Jesus said to them, All cannot accept this saying, but only those to whom it has been given. There are eunuchs who are born thus from their mother's wombs, and there are eunuchs who are made eunuchs by men. There are eunuchs who have made themselves eunuchs for the kingdom of heaven's sake. He was able to accept it. Let him accept it. 